Hey, Enigma Hood here. I just wanted to comment on uh, this 9-11 uh, truth movement bullshit. Um, uh, just to put it uh, straight up, the 9-11 truthers are by far the stupidest individuals that you'll ever meet, ever. They're even, they're almost as stupid as creationists. Um, where do I begin? Well, basically, I was, w I was watching this video about these 9-11 truthers who, uh, invaded, uh, Bill Myers, uh, pre, uh, pre-scheduled programming. And they interrupted it, they were yelling, they were screaming, saying how 9-11 was an inside job and all this other bullshit. And, uh, they were escorted out of, uh, the building. And I just commented on this video saying that, uh, it's extremely unlikely that the government was behind 9-11. If you don't really know what the 9-11 truth movement's about, let me... Okay, this is what Wikipedia says about it. The 9-11 truth movement is the name adopted by organizations and individuals that question the mainstream account of September 11th, 2001 attacks against the United States. Basically, their beliefs frequently expressed propositions among movements, blah, blah, blah. Basically, they say that uh, the United States government was behind the 9-11 attacks on the United States. That's what they're claiming. <sighs> hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty stupid. Think about it. Just think about it for a minute. Why would uh, the, the United States government uh, hire a bunch of Saudi Arabians, say to them, hey, you know, why don't you guys uh, commit suicide and uh, blow up a uh, part of our country? Isn't that idiotic? I mean, that's what they're proposing. Apparently, they hired a bunch of Saudi Arabians to, uh, they gave them flying lessons, I guess, and uh, uh, put them into you know, airplanes and uh, let them hijack them, and then they flew them into buildings. That would be how you would do it, right? They, they, and not just, uh, not just one or two airplanes. They would have, They gave them four airliners and uh, sacrificed uh, thousands of uh, uh, rich uh, businessmen in an expensive building complex, financial building complex, and uh, a military uh, facility, the Pentagon, and possibly the Capitol. But that one failed, apparently. But that was, uh, that, that, that's what they wanted to get. They wanted to get the Pentagon. But that one crashed in uh, Pennsylvania. So basically, this truth movement alleges that the United States government was behind those attacks. Uh, yeah, that, that's, uh, that's stupid. There is no way, there is no way that the United States government would um, sacrifice uh, thousands of its own people and... Uh, millions, billions of dollars for to further these ulterior motives. What really happened was um, the government, uh, the Bush administration, already had ideas of what they wanted to do, uh, but uh, they capitalized on 9-11. They weren't behind it, but uh, they, were, they capitalized on it, and uh, that led us into Lots and lots of problems, economic problems, war with Iraq, which was horrible and wrong. Uh, they they did all these horrible things, but they weren't behind 9/11. They just took advantage of it. So anyway, that's that's basically uh, how I f feel about the the 9/11 truthers. And I I wrote uh, a message, a very benign message on uh, that video, just saying you know hey you know, I don't think uh, the government was behind it. it. Doesn't make any sense. Then this idiot. This one idiot, uh, she calls herself, what was it, X Sam with two M's, Bam. X Sam Bam with two M's. Stupid name. Anyway, she uh, responds to me with this like essay long response saying how, how dumb I am and, uh, you know, how wrong I am. And I, I reply back and I say, you know, I, uh, I don't think I'm wrong. Uh, it doesn't really make sense. I do believe the United States government capitalized on the that incident, but I don't think they were behind it. Then later, you know, I, I look at her videos just to see if she's talking about 9-11 again, but most of what she's doing is just smoking marijuana 
you know, she's not even you know, talking about it. She doesn't have any videos about 9-11. She's like so obsessed over it and the 9-11 truth movement, but she didn't even have any 9-11 videos. Just videos of her getting high like a pothead. So I just said in one of her videos, you know, I don't think uh, smoking that's good for you. Then she like responds with another essay long response, you know, saying, oh, you're such a stupid idiot and uh, marijuana is so good for you. And then I said, you know, let me, let me look this up. So I, I decided to just do some sh quick research and it turns out, you know, there, there are all some health benefits to marijuana. I said, okay, you know, maybe you have something to that. And then, then, then I mean, even when you agree, you, you know how stupid a 9-11 truther is, is when you agree with them, but they still disagree with you. You know, it's like, what the hell is wrong with you? Then she gets this, like, uh, her friend, this, this, this fucking loser, Mike Kim or something, and he gives me another essay long response, smoking is bad? Did you just, you know, no shit smoking is bad. Yeah, I mean, I was pointing out the obvious. Uh, what does it say? You know, something about uh, how it's, like, uh, it's supposed to be good for you and, you know, the pain... Uh, it takes away the pain, death from... I don't know what the hell this... He's stupid. So I just uh, replied to him saying, are you a protector? I mean, does she need you to formulate her arguments? Because, you know, they, they all... They can't, they're not intelligent enough to, uh, to think for themselves, apparently. So I, I, I just said, hey, I, I was agreeing with her. I said that maybe there is something to marijuana that's, that's okay. You know? And then... Uh, then she then she replies back and, and and actually blocks me even after I agreed with her and said that she might be onto something with this marijuana, you know that's how stupid it was. But before she did that, she she wrote something on my my uh, channel. And by the way, by the way, she was the one who first you know, contacted me. You know she she wrote on my channel explaining about 9/11, truth and all this other bullshit. She she contacted me first. I didn't give a shit until she contacted me. Anyway, she she writes on my channel. Uh, you know, she's disagreeing with me about 9-11. No, I am not wrong. You are wrong. And so is this government. Now, since we already know you were wrong about marijuana, yeah, yeah, I admit. Maybe I was wrong, but maybe she's wrong, too. Can you also be wrong about this? No, I don't think I'm wrong about this. I recently woke up about 9-11. Yeah, right. You've been believing this ever since you were 12. If you haven't done any research for yourself, strictly believe the official story, you are wrong. I am not claiming to know exactly what occurred on... Stupid idiot. Well, I was going to reply to her, you know, she, you know, made some points, but uh, I can't reply to her when she blocks me from her channel, because just because she, you know, doesn't like debate. You know, that's the thing with uh, these truthers. They are so stupid that uh, 